I'm gonna g- put a hell no in your mouth real quick. All right, but, hell uh, no. Yeah, it's you should do Alaska via cruise, untouched nature. Mm. Can I get a okay? So hell no. So the problem with the Alaskan cruises is that you have to go through uh, rough water every now and then to get to where <laughs> the beauty is, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, so you know you do have to most. Um, of the cruises still go through the Bering Sea to get to. So there's no cruises that like start in a beautiful area of Alaska. And then you just cruise up to the little river and have fun. And you see all these beautiful things. Uh, you know, I wanted to do an Alaskan cruise <laughs> no, until, you did I, it. until I, I did. No. I was literally, cause everyone's like, Oh, they're beautiful still water. But yeah, it's still water. Once you get into, into the, the still water. Yeah. But you know, if you read reviews on, on, <laughs> on it, they, you know, like one out of 10 cruise ships goes through really heavy swells. Uh, and I would literally have a I would, fucking I would heart die. attack. I could, I, I literally would die. And to be so. honest with you, and this is some, you know, some photography stuff. If you guys want to, you know, do it, there's, that's probably like the worst way to get good photos. Like you yeah. could, it would be better to go run around with our own car. Well, that's the thing I want. Yeah. I want to, and that's the other thing is I'm not a big, like touristy, touristy guy. guy, you know? So, so like Alaska cruise to me is like for people that don't want to adventure, you don't know, want to really yeah. see Alaska. Like they want to kind of like look at it from afar, like snapshot. Oh, that's yeah. awesome. Yeah. But we want to go see Alaska. Yeah. You know? I want to go to places that like my yeah, feet on the like, dirt. Yeah. You know, I went on a cruise once. It wasn't that fun. It wasn't that great. I would go crazy on any cruise, even if the weather wasn't, it wasn't a, a factor. Like yeah. a Bahama cruise, you're typically pretty smooth, you know, on a huge ship. You hardly know. Although my daughter went on a, 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 a cruise, I think for the first time, uh, this last year, yeah. uh, well, the year before COVID, uh, and, um, and she said that, uh, she felt kind of sea like not seasick. She said she never got seasick and the, and the sea was pretty calm. She said, but, uh, when she got off, she said for two or three days, her equilibrium. Oh felt yeah. Like you she was still, still on the boat. Yeah. When you go and, take uh, a shower and you're like, you're in the, your shower at home, you actually feel yourself sway a little bit. Yeah. See, I would not like that at all. You know, <laughs> yeah. no, 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 no. So, so you can one, see already now that you're yeah, like, no, so no, no, no. one of the side effects of anxiety for me is uh dizziness and lack of equilibrium so i feel kind of like out of whack that's one of the the, the symptoms i hate the worst about my anxiety the physical symptoms so i will never want to do that on purpose <laughs> you know so uh so yeah no no thank you on the alaskan cruise um alan says hi brian it's feeding day today for my ball python nice. julius or julius i don't know how you say julio it. julius well, that's awesome. Well, I hope it feeds well for you. I, this time of year, sometimes ball pythons can be finicky. So uh, I wish you the best of luck. Uh, Keenan says, talking about breathing, I'm a private pilot. Mm. Uh, take a deep breath is going to become part of my landing checklist. Oh. Uh, just got a Sinaloan milk snake from you. <laughs> Thanks. She is beautiful. Oh, my gosh. I tell you what. Pri- oh, man, I tell you what. <laughs> I, you know, I, I have a couple friends that are pilots, and, and I love you guys, man. You guys are rock stars. And it, it is interesting, right, is because... I, I say, you know, isn't there something romantic about being a pilot? Yeah, you dude, know what I mean? I like, do. Like, it's one of those things, like, I own a restaurant. I, I'm a pilot. Yeah, I'm a, it's you sexy. Know, like, like you, you, yeah. you, it's like, it's it's romanticized. It's like, oh, wow, you fly, you know? And I think maybe, you know, that was even more so back in, like, the Pan Am area, right? You oh, know what I mean? Sure. Like, back in the 60s, if you were a pilot and you walked into a bar, you had every girl in the room, right? You yeah, know? yeah, yeah. It's like, oh, my gosh, a It's pilot. not like today where you're like, I have a ball yeah. python collection. But it's still, there's like, still what? that feeling, like, when a pilot it walks by in the airport you know with his hat and his freaking little wings on and stuff like that you almost still like you almost like oh this this guy's cool man this or this girl is cool man they're they're you know so so cool man i think it's awesome that you're a pilot and definitely i hope that your your <laughs> amount of landings always match your amount of takeoffs that's the sweetest thing you could ever say to somebody yeah, like him yeah exactly Damn, Damn, son. can we rail this in? So